Well, just wanted to show you guys what's going on in the shop lately. Uh, so, so far, uh, I've gotten this new machine, the uh, DMG Mori Sprint 20 5. It's uh, actually made by Guildmeister. The G in DMG Mori is Guildmeister. It's a uh, Northern Italian plant. Uh, I actually went to there on my uh, honeymoon uh, last April. Anyway, uh, got an edge bar feeder, uh, it's got a panic control. Um, luckily, on all those Swiss lathes, there's tiny little work areas, uh, and it's still a pretty tiny little work area. Uh, but it's got this nice big door, uh, so you can actually get in and do stuff with it. Kind of loaded up with tools. I actually bought this machine specifically to make mechanisms for uh, bringing back the movers and shakers. A lot of you guys have been asking about when those are coming back, and I, you know, I discontinued those last year. The mechanisms came from a German company. They didn't last as long as I wanted, so um, discontinued them until I could get this machine. Uh, we're still working out the prototypes, so I don't really have anything to show off just yet, but it's coming in the next uh, month or two, hopefully. Uh, we're, we're getting real close. But we do have this uh, machine up and running, and it's got all sorts of cool tools and high pressure coolant, and uh, it's, it's a pretty neat little machine. So over on the NLX, the uh, bigger DMG Warrior that I have, the distance between spindles is uh, 500 millimeters. It's about uh, 20 inches. The distance between spindles on this machine is 6.7 inches. So there's a whole lot less travel. It's just a neat little machine. Uh, it's going to do some really cool stuff. See that soon. Now, time to go back into the uh, office. I'd like to show you guys the. Uh, oh, sorry, it's dirty in here. Uh, so I can show you guys the new anodized pens. So about a month ago, I uh, dropped off about 200 pens. Um, yesterday, I was able to pick up uh, those, and about 170 turned out well. I always lose a few in anodizing. Uh, anyway, long turnaround time, but it is uh, Type 3 uh, hard anodizing. Uh, you know, it's uh, the hardest bearing of all anodizing, uh, and these look great. Uh, blue came out a little brighter blue than I was hoping, but it still looks really cool. Uh, dark reds look very similar to previous dark reds we've had. Um, you know, they're just sliders and lighters. They're made uh, out of aluminum, so they're going to be the lightest weight uh, of all the ones we've had. They're going to sell quick, so I'm going to send out uh, an email to the email list. I'll put them up on Instagram, and you know, if you want one, go ahead and grab one soon. They're going to be 59 bucks on my website, and I'll uh, link that in this uh, video. Thanks, guys. I uh, hope to be showing you some mechanisms here real soon. Bye.